It's David and I'm here at the Essex County Environmental Center. Today I'm going to share with you how to make a frog egg bubble wrap craft. So the reason for this is that we can actually recognize frogs just by, be, just by finding their eggs. If you were to go walk up to a frog pond ecosystem to a wetland and you find eggs in the water, you can actually look closely, examine those eggs and determine what species may have left them there, may have laid them. So if you were to go early spring, if you find a long strip or string of eggs, that would be from the American toad. Up next, you might see a clump of eggs, like a ball, almost a, maybe the size of a tennis ball attached to a stick or even just floating on the surface of the water. That's a very good indication that there are wood frogs, an incredibly well camouflaged frog that may have visited the pond uh, and deposited eggs. You might find individual eggs, a single egg attached to vegetation, or many, many single eggs attached to vegetation under the water. Uh, that would be a good indicator that there are spring peepers living there. The spring peeper frog. And the last one, the one that we see most often here at the Environmental Center at our frog pond, is the green frog. The green frog will lay a floating raft of eggs. So you might find um, as many as a thousand eggs floating on the surface of the water uh, in what looks to me like a raft. If you were to find these eggs, you can actually quickly identify what species lives in that pond, even if the frog is out hiding in the forest somewhere, even if it's not still at the pond itself. So what you can do with, um, with the bubble wrap that we provide in the kit, you can take, you can take, a, uh, take a Sharpie and you can mark your, your little embryos within the eggs. Um, and you can use the scissor as well just to trim up that bubble wrap to try to make it as, as accurate of a representation as you possibly can uh, to help, uh, help you learn and better recognize what those frog eggs are when you go off and explore and you do find them out there on your adventures. So thanks for joining me today. That was how to uh, identify frog eggs and how to make uh, fro a frog egg bubble wrap craft.